I got the trigger. No, you don't. Yes. That's a bigger one than the last one we got. Oh, 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 oh. Got one. Oh, what the heck? There's two of them. There's two of them. I have never seen 90% of the things we're finding on this island. What is going on, Carrells? Welcome back to another video. Out here with Dearmate for Dinner, Robert Arrington himself in Rhoda. This place is epic. We actually just went to a local's house, probably one of the biggest fishermen here. Absolutely. And he hand made this net. This is like screening from a backyard to like a porch. Looks like he's got big, heavy pound test uh, fishing line on there. Some sort of wire down here, uh, duct tape. Uh, looks like the main whole entire ring of the net is a bent spear shaft. It is. That's a what that is. That's shaft. ingenuity. That is literally... Dog tooth tuna bends your shaft. You're like, heck, I'm making a net out of that. That is insane. Anyway, look at that. That's how they do it around here in Rota. But we got our net. We just needed something to net, maybe a little bigger fish that we'll find in those rocks. Bottom line is today's main goal is to go down to the water, find those rock pockets that when high tide comes up, the fish get in them. Low tide, it drops back down. Those fish get stuck in the rocks. We're gonna go rescue them. Yep. See a bunch of fish that we've probably never even seen before. Right. Maybe the find reason, crabs. The reason that is, the, the wading birds here devour all the reef fish. High tide comes in, fish go into those pockets, tide goes out, wading birds are like, <laughs> e easy meals. Easy, easy meals. meals. Dun, dun, dun. We're gonna find all sorts of stuff out there, so be sure to stick along. If you haven't done so already, hit that subscribe button, join the family, and uh, let's get it. I'm a part. That was, uh, that was called the turkey. And someone knuckles in. All right, anyway, all right, we'll see you at the water. <laughs> All the doors open, the doors open. We got a pocket, meaning the water gets this high eventually. We're probably not fully at high tide just yet. Um, this is a pocket of water and there's a bunch of gobies in it. So the bottom line is we're gonna get this net and start dipping. Hopefully we can catch something and release it into this bigger body of water. How, how, do you think the water even gets that high? Any, like, I think that's just when storms come or something. I gotta get in. Try not to stir up the water. Holy moly, it's freezing. Got something for you. It's one of the rarest shells you'll ever find in the Pacific. That's a pink striped cowrie. Literally one of the rarest shells in the Pacific. Oh my gosh, dude, yeah. that's sick. Literally found it right oh! there. Oh, dude, there's something on my foot. We gotta catch this, I don't know what it was. That's insane. Emptying out the water, because there's too much water to even try to catch them, so. I'm just gonna push some of the water out, and maybe that'll give me a better opportunity of catching one of these things. They're so fast. If I had a hole about that size, I can catch them with my bare hands, but I don't see any of them in here. Oh, 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 got one. Rob, I got one. Okay, let's get out of this water so he doesn't jump back in. All right, I caught that, ow, 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 these rocks are sharp. I caught that one just randomly scooping. All right, let me show you this little creature. Oh, whoo! That right there is a water goby. So these things, they can live out, literally walk out of water, they'll jump, that's what that jump is for. Um, they actually will come up on land and like sit there and then when they get spooked, they'll just jump right back in the water. They were trying to jump into the bigger body of water already. Look at that. That right there is an amazing looking fish. Call him Skitter, Skit something. Caught that again. Dude, you gotta have fast hands holding these things, literally. Holy moly. Anyway, that's the first fish we caught. There's a ton of them about this size and a little bigger that are hanging out inside there. But so I'm gonna release him into the bigger part, which he might go back up in there one day, but at least we saved one so far. All right, so this fish, I'm gonna put him back. Now those birds have plenty, there he goes, have plenty and plenty and plenty of fish to eat from. So it is the cycle of life. They eat, the fish sit in these holes, but we're gonna catch a few of them just for the fun of it. We're out here in Rota, and we're trying to do some stuff that's different. Not something we could do at home, that's for sure. We don't get rocks like uh, like this fella right here. Right there. Got it. It's the same thing, but bigger. That's a bigger one than the last one we got. Ooh. Oh. Dude, dude they they're like, jump. yeah, they're like snakes, dude. Crazy. Look at that. <laughs> it's called a goby. They actually burrow out little holes, and they stay in holes. 
and they use their front peck fins when little shrimp or food comes by, they just go Rawr, and come Same out thing as like thing. a mud skipper, right? Yeah, just like a mud skipper. Look at the colors on that. That's probably one of the coolest fish I've ever seen. Yeah. Imagine that in a fish tank? Yeah, and let's think Salt. about, oh dude, that in a fish Salt tank would be epic. Tank. But think about like big picture, you see the whole island and the, the grandeur of this. But Look then behind as, us, yeah. look where we're catching these things yeah, in. Yeah. But then as you get low, 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 even down to tiny little fish like that, the beauty around here is just breathtaking and you caught that thing. <laughs> I like his name, I'm gonna name him Jumpy. Adios, brother. That was sick. <laughs> so fun. Super dope. All right, let's get some. Uh, let's get some more. Got a crab. <laughs> Robert. Crab! Take this thing out. No way. I don't know what kind of crab that is. It looks like a mangrove crab. Is this what crab. we were, is that what you guys were eating yesterday? No. Oh yeah, you know what it is. The rock crab is. things. Dude, that is the best bait ever. Yeah, for uh, sea sh uh, sheep's head. Check that out. Catching crabs, catching fish, catching all sorts of stuff. You gonna hey. pinch my nose? Can you pinch my nose? All right. He's a, dude, this is a friendly island. It's yeah. a friendly crab. He is, we should let him go. Yeah. Yeah, come on, buddy. Hey, I got something really cool over here I just found I want you to see. All right. All right, buddy. You look how good he blends in with the rock. Look at that. Gone. Oh. Never even notice him. That's so cool. All right, what do you got? What is this called, Rob? A lily snail? A lily. A lily. How awesome is that? He was chilling in that little cave there. Look at Dude, look how everything is camouflaged here. Everything. You barely even notice that. Look how cool that shell is, though. Chilling. We're finding all sorts of stuff out here. Not only fish. Oh, this is wild. Look at that. All right, we're going to put him right back where she was. In the exact spot, because I'm sure there's a reason why she's right there. Hiding from her predators. Oh, what the heck? There's two of them. There's two of them. I have never seen 90% of the things we're finding on this island. Never have seen this in my life. Dude, what is that? What in the heck is going on? Yeah. That is disgusting. But we're just gonna show you anyway. <laughs> that's what nightmares are made of. That's some kind of tapeworm. Dude, that thing looks like it just wants to go in your skin and <sighs> bury itself. Monsters inside you. Literally, oh my goodness. What in the heck is going on here? I dare you to take a bite out oh, of it. Oh, no, 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 you ain't catching me doing just, that. Just no, bite its head nope, off. Nope, nope. Dude, that thing will grow another whole body inside of me. This is the fourth? The fourth thing that I've never seen on this island. I have no idea what this thing is. <laughs> if you know what it is, let us know. Comments down below. It's trying to bury itself in between our screen, but we're gonna try to get it out. I don't wanna mess with this thing. PK, good find, bro. Keep it going. Robert's found a snail. PK's found the parasite that wants to go inside your body, and I've found the fish. Let's keep it going, dude. Who knows what we'll find next? All right, Paul. What are you doing? Give a shout out to your mom right now. Your mom always tells you to fish more. I got you a rod. I got you a hook. I got you bait. And there's fish right over here. Give me the net. All right, so we got some sort of meat you found. What is it? Was it in the back of the truck? I, yeah, <laughs> no, it was next to the truck. We just found something that looked like roadkill. Dude, it looks like deer. <laughs> Could be deer. It's like black. All right. We're gonna try to catch a fish right now. I don't know where. Maybe we might have to go out to that the reef, the ed reef edge, but right here, you think? I still know how to cast a rod, Robert. Look at him going to it. Oh, you're about to get him. Eat it. I lost it. I lost the fish. I had him on and I lost it. This is what rookie mistakes are. You got any more baits up there? Yep. All right, let's get it. We're catching one. Come here, it's gonna happen. Oh, yes, dude. Right there. Right there. I got the trigger. No, you don't. Yes. No, you don't. That's the one I want. Yes. That thing is so cool. This is only like two pound test. Dude, look how sick the colors are. Oh, my gosh. That's incredible. Look at the colors on that fish. 
Oh. I have never seen anything like that in my life. Look at the colors. Robert, dude. Knuckles. Coolest fish I've ever seen. That was catch. so random. Oh my goodness, look at that. That is the coolest fish I've ever seen. Freaking stunning looking. Ow. Is that insane or what? The dude, color. I saw this thing. thing. I saw that. <laughs> we should eat that thing. Listen, if you're watching deer meat for dinner right now, that would be a catch cleaning. Hey, coat. no, no, no. He definitely got to. He's got to keep his meal. Take that off the hook. I'm giving it back to him. No, you're not. Yes, I am. I'm that nice of a guy. He didn't just eat that hook and get caught for no reason. You need your meal. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, look, look at the colors, dude. Let's get this guy back in the water. Put get him right swimming away. But oh my gosh, what are the chances of that, dude? The one I wanted ate it. Oh, you dropped your food, dude. <laughs> I, I want one of those fish that have the stripes on them that we saw earlier. That's gonna be awesome. Don't tell me about I, it. Tell no, I them. just wanted to let you know that. Yeah, well, okay. I have no control okay, over this. No, you kind of do. This I, is the only thing I have control over right now is a GoPro. Okay, here we go. And I barely have control. What over a cast, that. Paul! Great cast. Oh my gosh! Yo! Just, what the heck? That's a stinking <laughs> lane snapper! <laughs> Did you see that? I meant to pull the bait out to recast it, and it was just on. What is happening right now? This is one of my wildest videos I think I've ever filmed. Look at that. Awesome. Would right. you eat this? Yeah. <laughs> Dude, the Chimoros will eat anything. Whoa. Rolling? Rolling? Oh, yeah, we're rolling. Hot potato, bro. Here we go. <laughs> oh, we took off. He's like, GoPro I'm wasn't gone. even in the water yet. <laughs> Numero three. We went from netting fish in little holes, which we did, um, and now we're fishing off the rocks, and hopefully we can get one more with this last bait. Last bait? Yeah. Last bait. Here we go. That was raw. Dude, I didn't even get to freaking stop the line. It was, look at him chasing it already. The heck is Oh, I thought that was a fish. Dude, is that a fish? No. What is that? It's like a... What That's the... one of those huge worms. What the... That's one of those huge worms. Like a sea cucumber. Why am I catching these things? Someone tell me what in the heck that is, dude. <laughs> How did I catch that? I threw it out there. Look at that. And I caught a sea cucumber. <laughs> no, that ain't a sea cucumber. That's some kind of crazy worm. It ate your I bait. Bro, I gotta get out of this water, bro. Let me tell you. What the heck is this? I dare you to take that home with you. I'm not touching it. Look at him. Oh, look, look, look. Watch, look at him I, give, I give him the skin back and Hold watch on. him fill up. You see him fill up? Look at that. I'm giving the skin back. Look at that. Mm -hmm. Dude, that's sick. <laughs> All right, I gotta get the hook out. I don't wanna leave a hook in him. Oh, thank God. Thank God. So long. Look at that, you guys. Yo, what a wild video, dude. All right, well, if you enjoyed this whack of a video out here in Rhoda, be sure to drop a like. We're gonna head back to the apartments. I'm gonna do a positive comment shout out and sign off from there. But for now, dude, hey, what a wild If you wanna see video. something get catch, clean, and cooked, go over there. Head over to Dear Mate's channel. I'll have it linked in the description. Um, shout out to your cameraman, John. Oh, I just kind of rocked the camera. You're really steady, but thanks for filming this. I appreciate it. Um, wild video, dude. We went from catching fish inside little holes and pockets from high tide to just fishing and catching. I don't know what the heck that is. Pretty sure I got one of those parasites in my toe right now, but we're going to head back to the hotel. Thank you guys for watching. This was, this was insane. Best video. All right, y'all. That's all I got for you today. We did probably the coolest thing I've ever done on video. We caught all sorts of stuff, stuff I've never seen. Hopefully you've never seen, so that was really interesting. Thanks for being here. Thanks for tagging along. We're gonna be back home very shortly within the next two videos for sure. I cannot wait to get home. I got some bangers that are in the making, that's for sure. Like bangers, not even kidding. Like, mm, I can't wait to film. <laughs> Today's positive comment shout out goes to Diana. Hi, thank you for brightening my days with your videos. Thank you, Diana, for the support. And thanks to everyone down in the comments for all the support that I get. If you want to want a positive comment shout out, all you gotta do is drop a positive comment down in the description below. And now you could be in one of these upcoming videos. Thanks for watching. Until next time, I'll see you in the next video. Peace.